For as long as we've gazed at the stars, humanity has built theories, drawn maps, and dreamed of our place in the cosmic order. But today, that entire framework, everything we thought we knew about the universe, is trembling. Because what the James Webb Space Telescope has just revealed wasn't supposed to exist. Galaxies too ancient, planets too massive, structures too symmetrical, and the signal so rhythmic, so unnatural, that it defies every known model of astrophysics. This isn't just another scientific discovery. This is a confrontation with reality itself, a collision between belief and evidence. The James Webb Space Telescope may have delivered the most staggering invitation and the most profound warning in human history. And if what it's seen is real, then everything we thought we knew about the universe is wrong. In a series of deep field images, the James Webb Telescope captured the most detailed view of the cosmos ever witnessed, but hidden inside the beauty were anomalies that shouldn't exist. In the galaxy cluster Abel 2744, scientists found points of light arranged in unnerving symmetry, patterns too organized to belong in the chaotic universe we understand. In NGC 1365, a massive spiral galaxy. Strange gravitational motions were detected, movements that don't align with our most basic models of physics. The more Webb looked, the weirder the universe became. Identical patterns repeating across billions of light years, geometric alignments where there should only be randomness. At first, researchers called it coincidence, but as the evidence piled up, a chilling possibility emerged. Maybe we're seeing a form of order far beyond our understanding. Then came the exoplanet HIP 65 to 426b, and with it, the next shock. Orbiting a young star only 15 million years old, this giant planet is seven times the mass of Jupiter and lies farther out than Neptune. By all known theories, it shouldn't exist. There's no visible debris disk, no clear mechanism for its formation, no explanation for its impossible orbit. Some scientists have begun asking terrifying questions. What if this world didn't form here at all? What if it's a relic, a wandering survivor from a previous cosmic cycle, placed or left behind for reasons we can't yet comprehend? And then, there's the Einstein ring around galaxy J0418. Gravitational lensing is a well-understood phenomenon, but not like this. This lens is perfect, a complete circle of light, so precise that the odds of it forming naturally are astronomically low. Its near flawless symmetry hints at something deeper, that the structure of space-time itself might be more deliberate more geometrically engineered than we ever dare to imagine. But nothing, absolutely nothing, has shaken science like this next discovery. James Webb detected massive fully formed galaxies just 180 million years after the supposed Big Bang. In cosmic time, that's impossibly soon. Our models say galaxies need billions of years to grow stabilize and form complex structures. Yet here they are, ancient giants glowing across the void, mocking our understanding of how the universe began. If these galaxies are truly as old as they appear, then our very concept of the Big Bang may be wrong. And maybe, just maybe, there was a universe before ours, and remnants of it are bleeding through into what we call now. And then came something even stranger. In a seemingly empty sector of space, far from any known galaxies, Webb recorded a powerful gravitational lens effect, bending and distorting light with no visible mass to account for it. Scientists first assumed it was dark matter, but the strength, the sharpness of the lensing, suggests something else. Not a cloud, but an object. A hidden structure 
with defined edges, mass, and influence. Something unseen but built or left behind. And the mysteries didn't stop. Webb also mapped an intergalactic filament over a billion light years long, a colossal string of galaxies lined up with such mathematical precision that it resembles an artificial grid. Mainstream science claims its gravitational evolution, but some researchers whisper that if the cosmos was ever shaped by an ancient intelligence, this would be the trail they left behind. And then came the pulses. During a deep field scan of an empty void, Webb detected regular rhythmic light flashes. Not a pulsar, not a quasar. The signals repeated with machine-like precision, then abruptly stopped. Multiple systems confirmed the finding. No technical error, no random noise. A silent beat from a place with no stars, no heat, no light. A message not meant to be understood, only to be noticed. The James Webb Space Telescope was built to look into the past, but maybe it revealed something deeper. That we're part of an ancient design, a system governed by a blueprint older than stars, older than galaxies, older than time itself. Galaxies that shouldn't exist, planets defying every rule, gravitational shadows where there should be nothing, signals pulsing from the darkness, Structures hinting at intelligence. This isn't science fiction. This isn't conspiracy. This is the universe itself, whispering that we were never truly alone. Not in time. Not in space. Not even in thought. Maybe the cosmos wasn't just born. Maybe it was built. So now we ask you, are we discovering the secrets of an ancient architect? Or are we simply projecting human hopes onto a cold, indifferent universe? Tell us what you believe in the comments. And if you want to keep following these cosmic riddles, subscribe and turn on the notification bell. Because the next image from James Webb might not just show us where we came from, but where we're going. We'll see you beyond the veil.